And that caused me to reflect that in human living, it is also what is within each of us that causes us to advance and especially to reach the heights. Hello my friends, it's always a joy once a week to come to you via this medium that is so readily available to us. I could never do that on my own, but I have a good friend that so kindly stands week after week behind his camera and he's the one recording these messages that keep coming to you with my hope and prayer that it will provide something unique, something to cause you to think, and then to act on what you think. I just uh, came to think of something very special once again, something about which I have both read and heard so many years ago. I don't even know how many. But for some reason, it's one of those stories that stays in your mind for quite some time. It related to a public park, maybe a big square in the midst of some city or town, where an individual was entertaining small children by filling with gas many rubber balloons of various colors. But instead of selling them or giving them freely to any of the children, he was simply letting them go. Something which greatly fascinated those youngsters, many of whom had never seen anything like that. They were puzzled by what would cause the balloons to reach the heights and disappear completely from sight. Suddenly, a young boy may be four years of age, came to him with a question. He inquired, Sir, if you had a black balloon and filled with gas, would it be going up too? <laughs> the man smiled and said, Of course, Sonny. Absolutely. It is not the color that matters. Any balloon of any color will go up once filled with this gas which you see me put inside. It is what is inside that counts, not the color of the balloon. And that caused me to reflect that in human living, it is also what is within each of us that causes us to advance and especially to reach the heights and to be able to accomplish great things that will benefit others besides ourselves. I have a saying that some of you may or may not have heard me affirm at some point in one of these videos, to the extent that while many people prefer the rat race, remember that we are all called upon to soar like eagles, to go as far high as we can go, because that's where we truly belong. There's a time to return to the earth and to accomplish our tasks here at this level as well. But we do not need to be confined to any position because God himself puts within us the will to move forward, to advance, even to reach the heights. And I hope that this is your desire, regardless of age, regardless of your condition in life, because you have the human resources available to you to be able to advance and to go far and to achieve things beyond your imagination with the help that God is so ready, readily prepared to provide for you and to do through you. So think about that, my friend, and do what you can 
and seek the aid readily available to you to achieve great things and flee from total mediocrity that is so abundant where we are. Bye-bye until the next time.